Hey guys, welcome back to Life is Strange 2, part 5. So we're at the grandparents' house. How do you feel? I still don't think Super they warm. want us here. Wait, but... it's nice and warm in here. And the food? Yum. Yeah, <laughs> feels good. Feeling better? I don't feel like her person. very much. Yeah. I love that bed. Mm. Thanks, Grandma. Good. Your temperature is down. I'm way better now. You <laughs> still need to take it easy. How about if we say a little prayer and, and give thanks? It's like a bedtime story, <laughs> right? Well, this is a bit like this, yes. Except they the don't story know comes prayers from like up there. <laughs> the ceiling. The ceiling. <laughs> so, are we ready to pray? The Just ceiling. Follow my lead. Okay. Oh. Sure. Sure. I feel like it might be good for Daniel. We need all the help we can get. Can you ask the blessed dad? And Sean. Um. And Mushroom. Mm hmm And you and Grandpa. And, uh... Let's just bless everybody. Everybody else. <laughs> oh my. You are so sweet. Thank you, Lord, for bringing Sean and Daniel safe and sound into our house. I still don't trust her. Care, she makes me uncomfortable. Um, uh, mushroom. There we go. Mushroom. Please give us the strength to get over the hardships of the past and the trials yet to come. Amen. What do you mean by trials yet to come? Amen. Like, are you going to give us trials or... I don't trust her. Okay. It's bedtime. Try to get some rest. You still need it. And no roughhousing in here. No worries. We're too tired. Good night. Oh, and thanks again. <sighs> Good night, Grandma. The light switch is already down. <laughs> It feels so nice to have a bed again. <laughs> I'm sure it does. And a bathroom. Even if you have to share it with that. me. Plus, you don't smell anymore. Whatever. <laughs> well, Claire seems pretty caring. Mm. And nice. I don't trust her. I guess Steven is too. I hope we'll be fine here. I think so. We can't stay. I don't think we're going to be allowed we to stay for long. Thing. She'll have time to get better. Sean? Hmm. Are we in Mom's old room? Nah, I don't think this is the one. Not from what I remember. But it's been a while. Could we check it out tomorrow? Maybe. Maybe find some of her stuff? Maybe. Why? Why would you want to do that? I just don't know anything about her. Daniel, I understand. But we need to focus on where we are now and where we're off to. Mom left us. She made her choice. Mm -hmm. We gotta make ours. And we can't keep going back. I still think he's in like some of her, like the mom's old pajamas. Yeah. I guess. Hey, man. I know he wants to know about his mom. I can get that. so great with you. Well, hmm. you know, I was wondering, how do you do it? Uh, I don't know. I concentrate and it just happens. Oh, we, we want the powers. Does it hurt feeling strong? Wait, does it hurt? It's kind of itchy, though. Itchy? And exhausty. Sorry. Anyway. He wants the powers. Remember the rules, right? We really don't want Claire or Stephen to start asking questions. I know, I know. I hope they aren't, like, listening on the other side of the door. Don't show, don't talk. Just keep that in mind and... Conceal! Don't feel! Don't let them know! <laughs> Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay, where's Daniel? We're in a different outfit. Has it been a few days now or something? Oh, is that Mushroom's bandana on the windowsill? I'm surprised they've let the room get this messy if what Sean said about Claire being a neat freak is true. Oh, man. I could sleep all day long in this bed. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Oh, the grandma's I laughs a little weird. <laughs> Dad's picture. That's cool. Claire dug this up for us. Dad's such a baller in his suit. I wonder if they like actually liked our dad or not. Oh, man, I miss that dirty little dog so much more than I thought I would. I don't even know how Beaver Creek looks like. We're not allowed to get out. Mm. This is pretty good so far. I love that Steve only has crime and train books. <laughs> Dice. That's a cool memento of our secret cabbing in the woods. Earmuffs. Thanks, Claire, but I will never wear these things. <laughs> What am I? Go downstairs to have breakfast. So many more pictures. Are these all of Daniel's toys? Blanket. Book. Canteen. Daniel was training his precision with these. <laughs> Fucking awesome. It's gonna be the same stuff, isn't it? Yeah. Space yep. toy. Daniel knows how to milk grandma for toys. <laughs> Good. He deserves to be spoiled. See, my my dad's parents um can't believe we actually didn't really buy toys. They would more like go out and buy us like body. snacks. And Pretty my badass. My um, <laughs> mom's parents always Daniel found like a used toys. My grandma loves to go yard sailing. So, like, we never got new stuff. It was Sean. always used stuff. Sean, are you awake? Breakfast almost done, so come down when you're ready. <clears throat> okay. This is really cool, though. So careful, Chief. I'm glad they get along so good. <sighs> What's up? Ah, look who's here. But uh, you're too late for the 915 Express. Ah. Um, it's okay. This is really cool. I'll take though. the next one. It will leave after breakfast. Okay. Don't be late this time. I won't. I won't. Is there anything else up here? I can go in like the bathroom and wash up. Wash face. Oh man. How did we survive? How is he not growing a beard? I used to hate brushing my teeth. Just now it's like a luxury. <laughs> now I can't get enough toothpaste. Saw some teeth in there a few nights ago. I wonder if it's Claire's or Steven's. <laughs> I find it funny that he keeps wow. dressing them as they sure did stock us up on clothes like their for the first winter. name. I'm not close with my grandparents on my mom's side. And my mom wants us to address them as their first name. But Hope I just find it really weird. To a bar to take a shit. <laughs> Medicine, towels. I'm just going to go. I don't know what's going on with the lighting. I don't want to be... I don't want to go tramping through stuff. I'm just going to go ahead and go downstairs. That it actually lets me without having to like transition. Get the kitchen quick. Claire's waiting for us. Hello. Oh my! Look who's awake. Hello. Good morning, sleepyhead. It's that. Oh. 
I didn't mean to cut Daniel, him off. Mm. Breakfast time. Your brother is ready. Grandma showed me a box art. Steven, your grandson needs to eat now. You can show him the box car later. <laughs> Get more on the grandpa than you are on the grandson. And there's me. I'm just kind of the outcast. Need help? Do you need help or anything? Oh, don't worry. I can do this in the dark. <laughs> Thanks for the offer. All right, all right. Are you boys done playing? We had an express delivery with the passengers. <laughs> but the engine broke down. Yep, has to go straight to the workshop. Good. No trains in the kitchen, remember? Gotcha. Her voice Cheers. sounds familiar. I feel like I've heard it some. I don't know. I'm gonna look it up. Um, but um, but um. Ah, uh, sugar. He can fix his trains, but Strange not my kitchen. Please get us. Okay. Make enough. Everything's okay. It's great. As usual. You're the best cook ever. <laughs> Looks like you're getting cozy with this new country life after all. Claire. Do I recognize anything? Oh, I miss Seattle. It's nice. Yeah. Do I notice anything nice else that she's away in? From everything. Feels like we're the only ones out here. Not that I'm seeing. That's exactly why we love it. But she just sounds familiar. Safe. Unlike the big city. Hmm. I get it. I like it. It's hmm. good. Well, bless your soul. You'd get along good with our neighbors. We try to lend a hand. <coughs> Chris. Like to Charles next door. He lost his wife, and things have been hard on him and his son. He would just get lost in Seattle. But we're all taking care of him here. How old is his son? I, I think he's your age. Well, now we're going to want to go outside and play with the kid. What if what if we save Chris next door, but Grandma sees and she's like, oh, what's going on? No, 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 do not, do not, do not, do not, sir, do not, do not, stop. Stop it, you crazy. What are you doing? Hey, oh. what's going on back there? Sorry. Nothing. Just tipped a glass over, sorry. Oh, and I thought Steven was a fast eater. Hey, Grandma? Hmm? I wanted to ask you something. Hmm? About that locked room upstairs. I told you, there is nothing to see in it, Daniel. Why were you in it this morning, then? Because there's a lot of old junk in there. And besides, it's not safe for you to explore, okay? But we'll be fine. Please, don't push it. <coughs> I'm waiting for her to boot us out. You sure We're allowed to go outside? Getting better. Why are That's we st here. staring at you so hard? And then we'll go. We won't be loud. Trump. But be careful nobody sees you. Stay in the back, okay? We are hardcore glaring at him. Maybe you should tell him that it was Karen's room. It's just a room now, Sean. Nothing to see. Why lock it that Daniel needs to know? Daniel needs that. He doesn't know anything about her. I know, poor thing. But his mother isn't in there anymore. Does she run so she ran away from them too. So nobody goes in the room, okay? Fine. I'm serious. Okay. His mom contacted you. I kind of want to know more about the mom, but at the same time, like, just leave it be. His mom, come on. Did I mom ever contact you? She only talked to dad a few times. Then she was gone. Yes, yeah, she was. You know, Sean? Hmm. I don't really want to talk about this anymore. It's over. Anyway. Okay. 
You have to respect my rules under my roof. Okay? I don't like how she- I don't like how she phrases things. Of course. Sorry. Always. I appreciate that, Sean. Now you better go find your brother. There's a shed with some old toys outside. I'll bet Stephen has the key. Tanny will freak. I hate how she phrases Thank things. You. Like if I put like one toe out of line, I'm gonna be gone. I'll be out. This is a really pretty house though. Very pretty. See, I don't think it's supposed to be flashing like this. I wonder where this was taken. I don't picture Claire and Steven as world travelers. Where was that picture of you guys on the beach from? No, oh, she's talking. It's really hard to hear, though. Oh, that's so cool. I could totally see you surfing. <laughs> Did you love it? Well, it was too much paradise for me. I think Stephen could have stayed. Dad said Puerto Lobos was like a mini paradise. Of course he would. Oh, what does that mean? That doesn't mean. We'll see. Hmm. I heard Claire rehearse some songs. <laughs> She's got the groove. <laughs> She's got the groove. <laughs> Pencil. Sorry getting upset, Sean. I, I just don't feel comfortable talking about all this. It's, it's whatever. Fine, really. It's just whatever. We don't. Oh, I'm glad I, I cut I him off. These. I always cut him off. Gives me something to work on when they're all watching TV. It's, it's fine, really. Oh, he started over. We don't have to. Heidi. Tried one of Claire's books yesterday. It's basically a telenovela with white old women. <laughs> Fireplace. Aquarium. I haven't seen any actual fish in there since we got here. <laughs> Must be something under the rock. Hmm. Board game. I better catch up with Steven and get those keys. Yeah, probably. Is he upstairs, you think? Maybe? With his trains again? See you tonight, buddy. Oh. Oh, I want to turn my sound back on. Of course she is. But she's in our thoughts as well. That's nice. Claire can drop pretty damn good. I guess it runs in the family. Hmm. I don't know when Daniel will be able to go back to his school. Okay, let's go look upstairs for Grandpa. Nope. No, I don't want to get. I'm gonna. I don't want to do anything to get in trouble. I don't want to be kicked out sooner than I, I need to be. Oh, there's Grandpa. I think I need a handy assistant. Can you hand me the glue in the cupboard behind me? Sure. Hold on. Hmm. Whoa! Careful. Sorry, I've, I forgot. That thing isn't too stable. <laughs> it just... Uh, okay. Sorry. My fault. Your grandmother keeps telling me, but uh, I'm a lazy old man. Hey, uh, can you close the door? I want to talk for a second. Oh, great. Oh. Uh, it's the power cable, of course. Yeah, it happens all the time. Love how our bracelet just cut through our hand. So, listen, I've uh, noticed things. Like what? With Daniel. Uh oh. You know what I'm talking about, don't you? No. <laughs> talking about the powers? Or, like, that he's an odd child. I'm gonna hide it. Um, not really. What things? Well, I, I'm not sure how to put it. Like, some kind of invisible Oh my god! Force, like, a holy gift or something. Um, yeah. I was hoping he just meant, like, Tanya this kid has, like, an HD or something. Superpowers, but that's it. That's it? Mm-hmm. Okay. But be careful, Sean. Now, he 
he's still so young. Sure. And by the way, let's keep this between us. Why? Are you saying like there's been superpowers Claire in the family before? Strong beliefs. She mm -hmm. wouldn't understand. Hmm. She adores Daniel. And just wants both of you to be safe and happy. Hmm. What I'm trying to say is maybe you should stay here with us. I know you boys plan to run to Mexico. I like the grandpa. I'm just. Why not? Thanks. Maybe we could, but. I feel like why I'm not? intruding. I know being out here in the sticks with us old farts isn't exciting, but this is your home now. And the game it's ends. Cool. Bye. <laughs> kind of different, but I just don't want you to get into trouble because of us. It's dangerous to be on the road. Do you I think mean, we have managed this your far. Your father would have wanted this for his kids. You don't know him. It's different now. Of course not. <laughs> but everything's different now. I know. I know. Well, just think about it. Mm. But don't torture yourself. I will. I will torture hey, myself. Uh, Claire said you had the keys for the tool shed. Oh, uh, sure. <clears throat> Here. You guys enjoy the sun. Hmm. Does the grandpa not find it weird hey, that we call them by the their shed. first names? It's probably a mess inside. Thanks. Okay. My grandpa always kept his shed really me it's really we're talking about him in the past tense see you in my lair if you were afraid of me really why no idea but i'm a big boy now oh is that mom we don't look anything like oh. her you found this i uh, i just forgot to uh... it's okay it's been a while since I've seen her. Seen her face. Uh, yeah. I like taking a look at it from time to time. Doesn't it hurt? Yeah, it does. But she's still my daughter, you know? Mm -hmm. I can't approve what she's done, but I, I, uh, I think I understand. Good. Hmm. I don't. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm sorry, Jean. Please don't. Uh, My mom's dad used to wear suspenders like him. To Claire about this, okay? Why are we keeping everything from don't Claire? Worry. I won't. <laughs> don't tell Claire about this conversation. Don't tell Claire about this. Um, can we get? Can uh, we like contact Brody? I'm sorry. I know you guys miss your games and your websites. I just want to contact I, Brody. Trust me, a, a break from all this can only do you good. Well, it's it's safer that way. Yeah, yeah. I know. Hmm. Fine. I won't contact Brody. Oh, there you are, Sean. Got the key? Hey. Mm -hmm. I have to go out and run some errands. Can you do me a big favor? Do you know how to work a washing machine? <laughs> Since I was about eight. Of course. Can you throw in yours and your brother's clothes after the next load? They're in the bathroom basket. Totally. Yeah. Uh, no problem. I just Thanks hope so I don't much. forget, like, Feel something that it promised me to do. tidying your stuff, too. <laughs> it's good for the health to keep the house clean. Definitely. Hmm. Daniel can help. Ah, and remember, for your own safety, no phone and no internet. I know, I know. Boring rules. Don't worry, Claire. Hey, Daniel. There's work for you. <laughs> There's work for you. I'm busy. Yeah, busy my ass. Tidy. Over here. Clean, clean, clean. Ship in a bottle.
I'm just kind of looking around. I don't really want to do anything. I get that he's Tidy. sick of clean kitchen equals clean conscience. Okay. Yes, because putting the cereal box away. Chores list. Yeah. Sean and Daniel, tidy room. Put clothes in washing machine. Hug grandparents. Oh, I thought it said something else. Door! Are we looking for Daniel? Is that what I'm doing right now? I already tidied stuff in here. I hope we won't get Claire and Steven into trouble. Okay. Search. See under the bed. No. Well, we need to ream his butt for being so. I don't know. Oh. Not careful with his powers. There's a word I'm thinking of, and now I'm just forgetting it. Please don't be in the locked room. Please do not be in the locked room. Where the, the hell is he hiding? Why do I get the feeling I have to go in I there? Know you're in there. Gotcha. What the? Behind you. Wah. Yeah. Very funny. You need to be careful. Grandpa's seen hiding. you. Seriously. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> what do I have to do? You tidy the mess in our room, and I take care of the laundry. Cool? Yeah, sure. Oh, it sucks. I know. Thanks. Okay, it's not like something I have to come back and do later. Why is he holding it so securely to his chest? He's like, my laundry. Where is the laundry room? Here? No? Yeah. Let me just throw our clothes in the machine and we're good. And here? Yes. Note. Huh. As always with Claire, I can't really tell if this is cute or bossy. Dear husband, if you do laundry, please follow these simple rules. Do not mix whites and colors ever. Use one cup of detergent, red box, for each load. If you wash my clothes, use the delicate cycle so you don't ruin any more of my clothes. Love, wife. Hmm. We're mixing whites and darks, though. <laughs> but it's our stuff, so I don't really care. Does this thing have? <laughs> okay. Do you put any detergent in with that? Is there stuff in the dryer I need to take care of? Okay. Ready to go outside? Whoa. <laughs> Look at all these decorations. That's so cool. Okay. Daniel, you ready? I'm not. Go out now. Yes. Oh, okay. It's like, please don't go out with like, no jacket. Be cold. Hmm. Oh, man, finally. So we're going to the shed. The outside reminds me of the cabin, right? Oh. That still needs some work, kid. Get ready for storage wars. What's wrong? <sighs> Frozen shut. Of course. Well, now the key's stuck in the lock. <gasps> Chris! Chris! Sean, look! Chris! 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 Ha 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 ha! Okay, so it was us. It was us, and Chris does not have powers like we do. Chris! I love 
Chris. Hello. Did you see that? See what? Um, see what? We just got here. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. Uh, I didn't see anything either. Oh, uh, oh, 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 okay. oh, oh, oh. Fell down into the snow. Dad says I'm kind of clumsy. That's an awesome costume. Yes. Who's your favorite superhero? I love Power, power Bear. Bear. Yes. <laughs> oh man, I have the Mega Power Bear. You should check it out. Dude, that's so cool. Chris, oh god. Look, I, I am so sorry. Are you okay? Uh, Dad, I'm fine. I oh. promise. Uh, are you sure? Listen, I shouldn't... Hello. Do you know them? It it's okay, Dad. They're cool. He loves superheroes. Even Power Bear. Ah, gotcha. Hi. Hey there. Hello. Are you staying with the Reynolds? Our grandparents. Oh, uh, yeah. There are grandparents. Uh, I see. Oh, jeez, Chris, you don't have any damn shoes on. I'm sorry, buddy. Bye. Let's get you inside. I, uh, yeah. Okay, Dad. <laughs> Thanks, guys. That's oh, when you pick uh, up your kid out of the Claire snow. Asks. Tell her everything is fine. Is it though? Is it really? Uh, never mind. See you around. Sure. Sure. There you go. Now you pick up the kid. Thank you. Thanks, guys. See you later. Yes, we will. <sighs> Daniel, did you forget everything about the rules already? Sorry, Sean. Did you want me to let him fall? Really? Hmm. <sighs> Run the rules. Concede. I don't want to give in to, like, I have to stick to the rules. But at the same time, I didn't want Chris getting hurt. No, you... You did the right thing. But listen. We can't let anybody know. We have to keep a low profile out here. He's like my age. Yeah, and? I bet you would have done the same exact thing. Maybe. Don't be mad. I'm not mad, dude. It's... Grandpa knows. It's over. Daniel, remember that we're hiding out. So no training and no showing off your power. Yeah, From Grandpa's on, already you seen you. with me all the time, okay? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I am at the neighbors. Oh, fuck. That kid never listens. Hmm. Get dressed. Supposed to do Okay. Time to get Daniel at the Arrogance. How did you know their last name? Ah! The close up of Sean I didn't really want. Claire? What does the sign on the door Steven. say? Guest room. Anybody home? What did the sign on this door say? Bedroom? Well. 
Looks like I'm home alone. Hmm. Does that mean I can explore them? I can't enter in either of those rooms, though. Oh, right. Sunday morning. Or at church. Karen Stephen must be at church. Note anywhere or anything? I can't interact with anything. Dude, move your ass. I am moving. Who knows what Daniel's doing over there? Well, morning sleepyheads. Back for at least two hours. We let you sleep in a day while we're at church. Back by noon for lunch. See you in a bit. P.S. The Christmas tree is perfect. Good job, kids. P.P. P.S.S. <laughs> Thank you for tidying up a bit. Maybe I could use Steven's laptop? No. It's been ages since I've had news from the real world. No. Leave. <laughs> I'm probably not playing the game right because I don't take like any unnecessary risks, but I just don't want either of them getting hurt. Okay. Let's get this Brack back home now. Why did the, his tracks just suddenly like stop? And I'm not leaving tracks at all. Why does Daniel never listen? Maybe I'm too soft with him. Mailbox. Single dad family. Way too close to him. Mm -hmm. But this dad's a drunk. Our dad was cool. Cycle bin. Wow. It's a lot of beer. That's a lot of beer. Mm -hmm. oh, it's such weird angles. Oh, we just walk right on in. What's going on here? Uh, Sean! Wait! Don't freak out! I can't explain. Let me tell him. Sean, I know it sounds crazy, but I have a superpower. You saw me yesterday. He's made. I know you did. Daniel is making Chris think he has the powers. Objects with my mind. Oh, a superpower. Really? Yes. Pretty cool. Well, that's pretty cool, Chris. So, you're like a superhero? I'm Captain Spirit. Captain I can Spirit. Bend any matter to my will. Hmm. But that's my secret identity, so you can't tell anybody. Okay. Oh, I can keep a secret, Captain Spirit. Now you're an official member of the Spirit Squad. If you okay. betray us, I'll disintegrate you. Oh. <laughs> nah, just kidding. Nah, just kidding. Oh yeah, we need a... Team Signal. Totally. I'm Wakanda. Super woke. Wakanda forever. <laughs> Sean's like, sure what have I gotten Sean? into? What is this? Silver Runner don't need one. El Diaz Blue Loco. I don't know. Something cool like El Diaz Blue Loco. Mm. <laughs> and they're like, no. Sounds like a super villain's name. Oh. But, okay. <laughs> okay. Because I think we're ready to roll. What's going on? Hello! Uh, excuse me. Who are you? I'm Sean. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, sorry, man. You're here for Daniel. Hey, let's make it official. I'm Charles Erickson. Nice to meet you. Hope you know that Daniel and Chris are a dangerous team. We better watch out, or they're gonna take over the world. Yeah. They share a lot of things. As thick as thieves. Can we go get the Christmas tree now? We're both ready to fly. Yes, yes, yes. The, the team has been waiting too long. Hey, you should come along, too. <laughs> no, we yes. should not go Can't out. Wait to see all the decorations. We should not be going we out. Should. We could buy Christmas presents for Grandma and Grandpa. But we should not be going out. They'll worry. Well, they'll worry if we leave the house. And remember, you still have to get better, Daniel. Sean, come on. You know I haven't done anything fun since I got sick. It's the first time I've been out for days. We won't be gone for long. The market's only a few miles away. Anyway, they'll be at the service for at least another hour. Yeah, Sean. I can show Daniel around. You can come with us. Oh, this is such a bad idea. Please, please, please. 
fine. Okay. So this is a bad yeah. idea. Not a fair fight. So let's go. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Let's see. Bad idea. Dangerous. This is a dangerous idea. Yes. Okay, team, uh, give me a time out to clean up the back seat. I'll I when don't I'm done. like oh, Charles uh, either. I don't can I use him. the bathroom? Of course. Oh, you'll see my comic books. I'm glad you're coming too. Hey, you want to see my toys? Oh, score! The new hot dog man. Since you're a new member of the team, <laughs> you have to know everybody. Okay. These are Captain Spears' friends. Okay. And his enemies. Dude, that's pretty cool. Can you guess who are the good guys and the villains? Let's see. I know this. I know this. Villain? Don't know that. The bad hero. Guys, the good guys. Not Villain. That easy, right? Villain. Interesting. Hero. Hero. Yep. Okay. How did I do? Not bad. You're almost right. It was a bit tricky. Okay, let me introduce them to you. Okay. This is Team Spirit. Oh, the, the dinosaurs on our side. On our side. There's the Forest Warrior, Power Bear, Marty Rex, and Sky Pirate. Okay. So, who are the bad guys? That's not Terrius and the Shark Stinger. There's also Snowmancer, but he's out in the garden. Mm. Captain Spirit. I couldn't remember what the dinosaur took care of him. He might need a little surgery now. But mm. they're all working for Mantroy, who is the real super villain. You should see his evil planet. Why doesn't Captain Spirit stop him? He tried, but failed. That's why he needs Super Wolf. Mm. You know, Daniel, to prevent Mantroy from hurting other people. <laughs> yeah, strength in numbers. Sounds like Mantroid is in trouble. Just wait until he sees what Captain Spirit can do now. Yeah, about that. Does your father know? Um, does your dad know about any of this? Did he see something yesterday? No, he didn't see anything, and the power didn't work yesterday. After I fell. Uh, must have been too tired. Okay, good. Um, I mean, he could be pretty disturbed if he knew. I'm definitely not telling Dad. <laughs> I don't wanna... He's gonna be so disappointed when we leave and the power goes with us. Stuff anyway. Yeah, like his alcohol. All cool with him? Chris, it's none of my business, but... Everything Are you okay? and your dad okay? Uh, what do you mean? I don't know. Um, Claire seems to be worried about you guys. Claire's always worried. <laughs> We're cool. Totally. Okay. He's just <coughs> an alcoholic. Has a hard time being on his own. That's hmm. all. Hmm. I understand. Well. I can understand that. But I hope you know you're not alone. Thanks, Sean. But I don't feel scared anymore. I have the power. And I have Daniel. Only for a little There's bit. We're not signal. staying here. Daniel, finish Come your on, Daniel. finish hey. your poop and let's go. Pro tip. Don't go in there. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> okay, squad. Let's roll. You need my jacket? I don't want you catching another cold. No, I'm good. Thanks. He's got a really nice coat. And don't be waving your arms around when I'm driving, okay? <laughs> yeah. Uh, remember, Daniel, don't mess around. All right. Hmm. Jeez. Jeez. Thanks for clearing the snow from the porch. You're, you're awesome. You're welcome, Dad. The 
it's kind of sketchy. I don't like that they're just chilling in the back of the truck. Kind of sketch. <laughs> <coughs> My bad. Sorry. It's just I'm waiting for this all to go wrong. All to go downhill. Isn't it illegal to have kids just kind of chill in the back of the truck anyways? Kind of reminds me of Chloe's truck. It somehow is in better condition than Chloe's truck. Not by much, but it is. Okay, buddy. You ready? Yeah. <clears throat> hey! You guys go ahead and we'll come back to meet you, okay? Brothers meeting. Sure. But Don't get lost. We need to talk, sir. I can't believe it. How many times do we have to keep going over the rules? Don't show the power. I know. Yeah, but now Chris, Chris thinks, thinks he has he power. Can do all this cool stuff. I wish he could. He reminds me of Noah. Who's Noah? I just miss having friends, Sean. Yeah, I am too soft with him. Stop lying to Chris. Protect the secret. Listen, I understand, but we have to be extra careful out here. We can't let people see you. You know the rules. Yes, I know the rules. But I'm careful. No, you're not! I only do things when it's me and Chris. Hmm. Nobody sees us. Yeah, nobody but me. What if it was Chris's dad? Or grandma? Or a cop? Or... Okay, okay. I get it. But I'm careful. No, That's you're not. not you have to be extra, extra careful. All right. I swear I will. Deal. I'm counting on you, Anna. Can I go see Chris now? Yeah, let's go. But don't forget what I said. Wow. So many trees. Yes. Walk right into me, why don't you? Uh, you coming, Sean? Don't I'm worry. I'm ahead of you. I'll be around. Fake snowman. Kind of creepy. Daniel Snowman wasn't that creepy after all. So, what do we do? We have to pick the one we like. Can Daniel help Dad? Of course he can. Awesome. I like the dad when he's Come not on, drunk. Time to lose. Okay, just tree wrapper. Behold, the giant condom machine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Sean. We'll have to tame the one we want. What about this one? <laughs> I'm just gonna land the like someone went nuts over this box. Houston, you're right. We need a strong tree to protect our base from evil elves. What about this one? I wonder what will happen to the trees no one buys. Who knows? That's my objective. Find Daniel a Christmas present. Oh. Santa mailbox. Dear Santa, we've been good kids this year. <laughs> Please explain this hot mess. Aww. Sure. I'm fine. This is so different from Seattle. Don't know if I can get used to it. Donation box. Please don't steal anything from the donation box. Is that a yo-yo? Daniel had one back home. Bet he loved this. I could get in, like, they would talk so much if I were to steal a yo-yo. From the donation box. This guy is looking over here. Better not try anything yet. Okay, so he will tell me. Face and whole panel. Whoa. The guy who painted that must have been seriously high. <laughs> Hello. They're all looking at me as I pass by. 
I don't I don't think I have money. I have nine dollars and three cents. Sorry, but no. Okay. Better find a gift for Daniel quick. While he's still busy with Chris. Food vendor. We only sell handmade local products. Come take a look. Oh. We could get a snowman for grandparents. You won't find better deals in Beaver Creek. Oh, day. There you go. Um, I'd like one of those snowmen things. <laughs> of course. They're handmade by local kids. Aw. Hey. Cool. Here you go. Thanks. Anything else? No. I'm good. Have a nice day then. Thank you. Yeah, you too. Thanks. Please don't tie me up in the back of your store and beat me. <laughs> cool. Mission accomplished. We better leave now before Claire and Steven come back. You think I can steal this yo yo now? I I know it sucks, but Daniel deserves it too. Tell me nobody saw it. Right? Tell me nobody saw it. I'm just looking. Okay, she was looking away. Uh, found what you were looking for, city boy? Um, yeah. Something for my little brother. You bought your brother something out here. Yeah. Damn. Poor kid. Sorry. I'm just a grumpy old gal. Me and my friends have been crashing here for the week. Mm. Nobody gives a shit about us. Yeah, I can tell you're not from around here. Uh, no way. <laughs> no, no way. Just here for the holidays. Ah. You got family. My grandparents. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love the grandparents. What about you and your friends? Road trip? Uh, I feel like it's a bad thing that we're talking really. about. We kind of hop from place to place, hunting for little jobs. And Must be a long ride. That's okay. I don't we know why we're. Why are we talking to trains. her? Gives us time to rest. Hmm. Wicked. Man, that sounds wicked. <laughs> you have no idea. It's free. And so fucking fun. Well, I feel like we could handle this, but fall, Daniel or, probably couldn't. We've been lucky so far. That's the best. Nobody tells us what to do. Huh. No corporation owns us. And you get to see so many cool places. Exactly. Next stop is Humboldt County, California. <laughs> Stoner break. Not even close. We actually got work over there. Sean, what are you doing? We've hit the tree with Chris. It's all crooked like an old witch. Okay. Oh. Hi. Who are you? Ooh, your hair looks so cool. Is it a wig? No. Uh, well, what do you think? Mm, I don't know, but it's really cool. I'm Daniel. What's your name? Hi, Daniel. I'm Cassidy. I dig your superhero outfit. I'm on a secret mission with my friend. Well, it's not so secret now. <laughs> I can tell. I hope you get your mission accomplished. <laughs> and what's your name? Oh, uh, Sean. I feel like we shouldn't be handing our name out. I, she's gonna turn around and tell. I'm so no, paranoid of everybody. Sorry, you went through some shit with the guys. How much you make? You ready? Dog. Hello, pups. Oh, is that your doggy? So cool. Yeah, he's been through a lot. Like most of us. How do you train hop so with the dog? Him. And he stinks. Yeah, you stink and you like it, huh? <laughs> well, he's not the only one. Have you checked your hair? I think it just twitched. You should keep your distance, dude. <laughs> never too careful. Hey, never too careful. 
Who knows what may crawl out of the air? <laughs> oh, the bros join forces. You're already perverting him, Finn. Sorry. I know suburban boys is your thing. <laughs> Are you kidding? You want to talk about your scoreboard, Hotshot? <laughs> hey, no worries. Come on, let's bail. It was nice meeting you, Sean and Daniel. Stay out of trouble, Goodbye. kids. Hope we see you on the rail someday. Yeah. See you around. That doggy was so cute. I miss Mushroom. I miss her too. Hey, excuse me. Huh? Dogs have to be on a leash around here. Too many strays. <laughs> Sorry, dude. We don't do leashes. Well, the city does. An unleashed dog is liable to a fine, so... Uh, you're gonna fine our dog? Well, that's not very nice. Loitering is illegal, too. And you don't live here, right? We're moving along. Right? Calm down, sweetie. We're allowed to visit the Christmas market. A dog's not gonna eat you? Look at him! You better watch your mouth. You punks are always causing trouble. This is a nice town, okay? Jeez. Someone needs to get laid. <laughs> He's out of pills. That's it. I'm calling the cops. Please don't. Oh God. Please don't. He's gonna call the cops on us, Finn. Chill out. We're leaving this shithole anyway. You guys don't even have a Santa for Christ's sake. <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas. Fucking parasites. Why did they fight? I don't get why he yelled like that. Now he's watching us. We should kick his ass. No! No, we should not. No, we should not. We should leave. We're gonna drop it. Oh, we're leaving. not get involved, man. This guy... <coughs> oh, oh, no! Doesn't look nice. You're right. Somebody just rang the doorbell. That's not good. Hold on. Actually, you know what? I know they're barking, but I'm just gonna end the part here, so... Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Um, and I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys.